Welcome to our lesson on forming algebraic expressions. So to write an algebraic expression from a written sentence is about identifying the keywords. And for question A, we can see the keyword is plus. And plus as a mathematical symbol is five add y. So this would be the algebraic expression for question A. And again for question B, the keyword now is total. And again, total means plus. So it is the total of 9 and b, which is 9 add b. And for question c, the keyword now is sum, and it is the sum of a, b, and 6. And because a and b are not like terms, we add them separately. So a add b add 6. So for question d, we have 7 multiplied by r, so 7 multiplied by r. But with algebra, we do not write the multiplication symbol because it can be confused with x. So we have 7r. We simply do not include the times. And for question b, the keyword now is product. And again, product means multiplication. So we have 3 multiplied by f. Again, we drop the multiplication symbol. So we have 3 f and for question d the keyword now is double and plus but with the order of operations we do the multiplication first so we have double a which is a multiplied by two and then we are adding the one a times two we drop the times and we always write the number before the letter so two a plus one Okay, let's try some more questions. So do you want to try and match the blue card with its corresponding green card? You can pause the video and resume it when you're ready. So we'll look at this one first, which we'll call A. And it is the sum of 5 and N, which we write as 5 add N. And then divided by 7. And in algebra, we don't write the divide, we write it as a fraction. So it is 5 add n over 7. So this one matches with this one here. For the next one, 7 multiplied by the total of 5 and n. So we're going to work out the total of 5 and n, which is 5 add n. And then we are multiplying it by 7. And to multiply this expression by 7, we put this into brackets and we have seven on the outside. So this will match with this one. And next, the product of seven, five and n. But now seven and five are like terms, so we can multiply them together. So seven times five times n becomes 35 n. So this one matches with this one. And finally, 7 plus 5 lots of n. Well, 5 lots of n is 5n. And then we add the 7. So this one, as expected, matches with this one. Okay, thank you for watching and I hope you found that useful. Thanks again and take care.